Don't mind if I do. Sorry, you might not want to eat. <laughs> if he wants to eat an apple, let him eat the apple. Thank you. Oh, as always, if you guys screw this up, I'll be furious. And if you do everything correctly, I will not praise you. Uh, oh, one last thing. Don't make fun of his ponytail. OK, that's it. Bye. Ah! Oh, 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 I see milk. Oh, this is why you should never eat fruit. I know. Please don't punch me, mister. I'm just a kid. Oh, my god. What have I done with my life? Nobody move until it gets closer. You want him to get close? Just trust me. When I shout, you blast him. Have you done that before? No. Well, it was amazing! It was all shut up. This entire building. That was close. Time to go. But you know, this almost makes us even for when you prank me by swapping out my hair butter for that super glue. That wasn't me. You okay, okay with you? I don't it think wasn't. Her. Wait, did I do it? No, Buzz, you did not. But I know who did. Oh, I love these. So who did it? I will tell you. Why'd you do it? Because you kept demonstrating pranks on me. That hurt. Get over here! Uh, you want a prank? Uh, you want a prank? Uh, you want a prank for your squad? This is a fake mustache. It's simply here for the reveal of the glorious teeth beneath. I just had my dentist put them in. You did that to your grill on purpose? <laughs> yeah. We, you guys don't like them? <laughs> oh. You better close your mouth, Ray. Tooth Fairy's gonna put a bounty on you. Yeah, you even close your mouth? <laughs> hey, uh, the Easter Bunny called. He wants his teeth back. <laughs> hey, I got the scissors, so. <sighs> Holy molars! We're gonna need a bigger boat. I think Joe's just walked in. <laughs> You kids don't even understand that reference. I spent my whole savings to get these put in my mouth permanently. You actually paid for those donkey choppers? And getting them removed is going to be even more expensive. Well, maybe you can get your money back by turning your teeth into billboards. Oh, yeah. We will pay top dollar for that kind of word of mouth. The <laughs> famous chefs, they are here. Famous chefs? I wasn't told about chefs. And this is highly sus. What is highly sus is that you added fresh cromulons to a human dish. I'm sorry, chef. You look a bit like my ex-girlfriend. Oh, really? Did she have a mustache? No, but... She sounds beautiful. <laughs> now go fetch us some dried cromulons. Yes. Right away, your chefness. <laughs> Oh, my bozy bozy, cut his binding so I can grab him immediately. Yeah, please, 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 come on. Okay, I'll cut them loose as soon as they admit they learn their lesson about Zeus. Oh, this guy. <laughs> I learned my lesson. Zeus are horrible. Cut me loose. Thank you, sis. Thank you. Okay, Alien Genuine Moments is legit better than our Earth version, but I learned my lesson. Please cut me loose. You got it, Bose. Hi, Glorp. Grable. Ray, have you learned your lesson? I learned nothing. 
Strong people don't learn. My bag, thanks. Well, you're welcome. Does anyone else have back problems? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm thanks. Good. Uh, I'll say, I'll say, uh, from what I gather from talking to the headmaster of swag, who, by the way, is an absolute stud of a muffin, mm, that handsome devil tells me that your youngins are quite gifted. Right. Uh, yes, I do believe that is the brawny built Billy's name. Uh, right, now, listen here. I'd like to offer a Mika, a Miles, a Chopa, and even a little old Bozy a free education at the live-in, dormitory-style, overnight, pre-college school for gifted teen. Ray, this is your third character this week, and none of us are buying what you're selling. Oh, come on, Bozy's mom was thinking about it. Oh, I wasn't thinking about anything. Goodbye, Ray. Uh, uh, can I talk to the dads? Please, dads are stupid. They'll, they'll fall for anything. Like, golf is a sport. <laughs> Their dads don't even know they were in Danger Force. Like I said, stupid. <laughs> and they're gonna stay that way. We're hanging up now. Hey, listen, your kids are superheroes whether you like it or not. They're better off with me than they are on their own. Goodbye, Bye, Ray. You know what, you three used to be cool. I'm disappointed. <laughs> I think they went out. It's Mitch and the Bottle Snatchers. Does anyone have eyes on the gold soda? Hang on, I'll get the lights. Hey, turn those lights back off, you turds. No. Well, I'm out of plans. Run! Going somewhere? No, oh, God, there's more of you. Let's recycle these Bottle Snatchers. Hey, boys, catch! Two days ago, I thought of a way to prank that town. You wanna prank Rivalton? You talk to me. What'd you have in mind? You wait until the middle of the night, then Miles teleports us all into Hee Haw Puree. Miles replaces all the regular chairs with prank chairs. Yes. Schwaz replaces their water supply with his new concentrated water. One sip is like a gallon in your guts. Yeah, I'm so bad. I love it. Bose, you still know how to build a brick wall? Sand lime bricks or fly ash clay? Sand lime, of course. Ooh, the lady has expensive taste. And I fill the whole place with nitro blast boomsticks. Again, that's just violence. Oh. Chapa, you install remote locks on all the entrance doors. These are all good pranks, but I wish we could see them happen. You know that fourth wall pee puree that we never get close to? Of course I do. We got one of the man's nets right over there. Huh. That's where I install the hidden cameras. <laughs> ah. Okay, so then what? Then we pop some popcorn, open some brightly colored sodas, and enjoy the swell view of Rivalton's getting pranked. We may have made too much popcorn. I, I totally forgot to tell you that you had jury duty today. Oh. Don't worry, I took care of it. Juror number nine, please state your name. I am Ray Manchester. Good enough for me, you're on this jury. 